I am like so excited for this. So Cody and I decided this year that we're gonna start our mushrooms. So we bought mushroom kits. So these are plugs, so they're like, you can kind of see little dowels that you just shove into wood. Uh, you drill out a hole, shove these in, and then cover them with beeswax. And then in two to three years, you get mushrooms growing. So these ones are shiitake. These ones are lion's mane. There, you can kind of see the plugs a bit better in there. And these ones are oyster. And then we also bought wine cap. So I am so excited to start growing these. Ah! Cody and I bought some mushrooms from Grow Mushrooms Canada. It's always been something I've been interested in and we seen a video on YouTube and as soon as we seen it, she was explaining what to do, um, where you put the plugs in the log and that seems super simple. So we've always been interested in, but didn't really know where to start. So that's a good starter. If you're interested, I definitely suggest it. They were super quick. They came to our house very easy. There's so many different kinds of mushrooms I honestly didn't realize. So you have to screw a hole into the piece of wood, put your plug in, hammer it in, and then you cover it with a wax just to seal it and that protects it until it starts developing in the log and then it'll grow outwards in about two years or so. So that is our plan. Um, we probably will only get one or, one or two done. We're hoping for all three, but <laughs> I'm not sure we will. Probably only show you us doing one because it's a repetitive motion. This is our first time, so we're probably not gonna do it 100% accurate, but I highly suggest looking into it if this is something that you are interested in and wanna do, because it does take, they say up to two years before you'll get anything off of it.
Perfect. First little teepee stand. <laughs> so it says it needs to be in no direct sunlight. So we ended up placing ours over here. Uh, we're just gonna have three teepees and then they can just grow and they're right beside a creek also so we can give them water because it says you have to give them a bit of water when it's really dry out. So I'll just show you here. So there's our house there. So we have this little wooded area here. Just kind of like shrub. But in the summer it does close in and get covered by all the trees up above. So this is our first little teepee of mushrooms. So we have it sitting on cedar because we had read that cedar is good and it won't mold or rot when it's laying on the ground. And then we have them just teepeed up there. And then we have the creek right beside it so we have a good water source for them. Thanks so much for watching this week while we built our first mushroom teepee. Anyways, we'll see you in the next one.